Heartbreak has struck the life of Broken Strings, singer James Morrison, as he copes with the tragic death of his wife, Jill Catchpole, at the age of 45. Devastated by the loss, the 39-year-old musician has canceled all work commitments, prioritizing the well-being of their two daughters, Elsie and Ada Rose. Gill, who was married to James since 2006, was found dead at her home in Whitminster on January 5th. While James has not yet made a public statement, a source revealed to The Sun that he is holding it together for his daughters and has requested privacy for the family during this difficult time. The grief-stricken artist is being supported by his family as he navigates through the profound loss. Gloucestershire police confirmed that the death is not considered suspicious, stating, the death is being treated as non-suspicious at this time. The coroner and woman's next of kin have been informed. Days before her passing, Gill had posted in a local Facebook group seeking a new rental home in the area, indicating a pressing need to move. Additionally, she had changed her relationship status to single and was not wearing her wedding ring. James Morrison and Gill first crossed paths when she moved into his mother's house as a lodger. In an earlier interview, the singer fondly recalled trying to impress Gill by serenading her with songs from Stevie Wonder's Key of Life album. Their love story evolved from there, overcoming challenges such as the difficulties of being apart due to James's demanding career. The couple's journey was marked by ups and downs, with James admitting to instances where their relationship was strained due to his frequent travels. Despite the challenges, they remained devoted to each other for 17 years, eventually getting engaged and tying the knot in 2006. As James Morrison grapples with the profound loss of his wife, the music industry, and fans alike offer their condolences and support during this undoubtedly difficult period. Our thoughts are with James, their daughters, and all those affected by this heartbreaking news.